It's not your typical office, the Euclid Jail in Euclid, Ohio, but for Recovery Resources team lead Michelle Lasky, it is. She has been a social worker for the past seven years. I wanted to be a social worker to be able to provide connection between people who are disenfranchised, who are not given the time or the effort, or who society sort of pushes to the side in order to help them feel like they're a part of a community. Michelle says often it's not until clients are in jail can they clearly understand their addiction or mental health. When I first came here, I didn't want to accept the fact that I had a drug addiction or that I had a problem because I'm a man. But in reality, you need help. You need someone to talk to. You need somebody to vent to. The services offered uh, have gave me some great tools and get on track with a, a positive support system. Part of that support system is showing clients you are invested in their future. Having us here to be able to remind them that they're humans and to treat them with respect uh, that they deserve as humans helps to make sure that they're not becoming institutionalized and that when they rejoin the community, they're ready for that. That if it wasn't for me coming here and being able to get in these classes, that it wouldn't be nearly as high as it is. You know, that I, I have hope, I have a bright future. Definitely has helped me along my way to see that I do have a problem and, you know, they actually care about what's going on. Although being a social worker can be challenging, Michelle says her clients are worth it. In Cleveland, I'm Anna Marie Campisi for Recovery Resources.